You suspect that your chronic alcoholic patient may be experiencing Wernicke's encephalopathy. If so, which of the following signs and symptoms led you to believe this condition may be present? Is it A, shortness of breath, jaundice, and dilated pupils? Let me get out of your way here. B, nystagmus, AMS, and difficulty walking or standing. C, blurred vision, dizziness, and unstable gait. Or is it D, pinpoint pupils, jaundice, and dehydration? So with Wernicke's encephalopathy, this patient has a deficiency in vitamin B1, also known as thiamine. Now, the one thing I want you to think about is potentially our patient has a poor diet. Maybe they have uh, alcohol misuse. Okay, so oftentimes in these test questions, we see that the patient's an alcoholic and I'm looking for an unsteady gait, AMS, and something called nystagmus or rapid eye movement. Now, even if our patient has a low blood glucose level, we always want to treat the thiamine first. We can give up to 100 milligrams IV. Okay, so the answer was B, 